Hey everybody, Graham here. So uh, this is kind of a quickie because I wasn't planning on doing it right now. But uh, imagine my surprise when I looked at my YouTube recommendations today and there was a new video from Smokey reporting that Chris Chan has returned to jail. So he is back from wherever he was, which is presumably the mental hospital. There's a thread on Kiwi Farms about it. I have not... I've not read the entire thread. I've only read the first couple of pages. Whoever started the thread got the screenshot of, of Chris's jail profile that Chris is looking thinner and uh, much less happy than he was in his previous mugshot. So what does this mean? So he was at the mental hospital and, and now he's back, presumably. Assuming the mental hospital is actually where he was, my guess at this, and, and this is only a guess uh, in, the, in the truest sense of the word, in that I actually have no real idea what's going on, but I'm just kind of taking a stab at it here. My guess would be that he was evaluated as to whether or not he's competent to stand trial. And the fact that he's back in the jail now uh, leads me to believe that uh, they decided that he is competent to stand trial because I think if if he weren't, he would probably still be at the hospital. My understanding is that the way this is this works is that you are evaluated as to whether or not you can stand trial, and if if you can stand trial, then you do, and if you can't, then you stay in the hospital until you can. At which point they send you back to jail and you know resume the process. So. Like I said, I, I don't actually know what this means. That's my best guess. But I was astonished to see that there was actual Chris Chan news. I didn't think we were going to get Chris Chan news for another um, another six weeks or so. So um, six weeks? No, more than that. It's the end of July, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, I didn't think we were going to get any more Chris Chan news until then. But we have some. So there it is. Chris Chan is back in the pokey. Hopefully, at least for my personal entertainment, hopefully he'll be writing some more letters. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to that. And if he does write some more letters, I'm really looking forward to finding out whether or not his stint in the mental hospital has disabused him of the idea that he's Jesus. I doubt... In the short time he was there, they could completely uh, bring him to reality. I suspect he's probably still, to some extent, living in Quickville with Sonichu and the gang. But I'm just kind of interested to see what his tone is going to be in these in the next letters, if there are any next letters. Uh, and I'm really hoping there are. I will link Smokey's video and the Kiwi Farms thread in the description. Uh, so if you want to get more information, Smokey didn't really say a whole lot more than I just said, although he says it more entertainingly than I do. And he's got, you know, cool WWE video game wrestling footage to go along with it. Whereas all I've got is my own ugly mug. But I do encourage you to check him out. I, I like Smokey a lot, and I, I want to support his channel as much as I can. So if you've not checked Smokey out, check him out. He's funny. He's a good guy. And that's about it. I, I'm i a little bit, uh, I'm, I'm kind of surprised and, and a little flummoxed by, by this. Just completely came out of left field, and I was not expecting it. But anyway, I will, I will see you guys in the next one, and have a great day. Uh, Graham out. Bye.